Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and uh, let's uh, talk about what is AI Explorer that will come to 24H2. Now, a lot of people are on the impression that this is AI within the File Explorer, and at some point I was on the impression that could be the case, but no, it's not. It's actually something entirely different, and we've learned today the minimum requirements for that to work. So. Just to be straight here, if you have a standard Intel and AMD CPU PC, you will not be getting this feature in 24H2. It is reserved to ARM-based PCs, more specifically the Snapdragon Elite uh, that will, um, X Elite that will actually come in a lot of PCs with a very powerful NPU. In fact, the latest tests of the neural processing unit of this uh, chip show that it is far more powerful than anything else on the market right now. So this uh, shows incredible power in that chip. What AI Explorer will be, if you guys remember in Windows 10, we had a feature called Timeline. Um, this is a feature that unfortunately was deprecated, which is sad because I thought Timeline was an amazing feature that had a lot of promise so you could go back in time and see different, for example, older versions of a file and that has been modified and so on. Timeline was really, really nice. So it would be a timeline style feature that logs everything you do, everything you touch, every app you turn on, every app in a browser, um, you know, word uh, processor and everything. And what it would do is gave you, give you a very powerful search capability, meaning you've uh, done a, uh, you've used an app, created a file, that had a specific task, specific set of uh, commands. You've modified it over time. Now you're thinking that maybe you want to go back to some older version um, and you don't know where it is. Well, you would be able with that AI Explorer in a very, very rapid way to click the search. And that search, you could just enter either words, uh, part of code, or whatever that um, you know feature that would actually pinpoint it towards what you did, and that AI Explorer would immediately tell you, "Here's a file. Here's the thing," and apparently in a very fast way. So that is uh, the promise of AI Explorer. And once again, it is in the documentation that we've seen today. Uh, it does say that it requires an ARM64 processor, specifically the Snapdragon X Elite. And I have the impression that there will be really two 24H2 type of computers. Us on the standard Intel or AMD based or what we call X64 based PCs that won't have a lot of new AI features, but those that are on ARM with that Snapdragon or to some point in newer Intel PCs that will have NPUs, those will have a lot of core AI features that us on X64 won't see. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.